Hey Brandy. Hi. So I'm excited because you have a few of my favorite things out here on the counter. Mm, chocolate? Yes. Cinnamon? Yes. Hot chilies? Yes! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> so um, what is that combination going to create? We're going to make a spicy mocha. All right. And so um, it's a it's a very detailed process, so we're going to have a lot of steps, um, a lot of waiting. Okay. So we're going to start with um, turning the heat on to high. We're going to simmer the milk along with three cinnamon sticks and three hot chilies. Okay. And how much milk is that? This is four cups of milk. Four cups of milk, mm -hmm. okay. So I'm just going to stir. We don't want the milk to uh, start to set on the bottom. It makes and kind of a layer. Burn. And so you want to stir constantly. Okay. Um, until it reaches a, a simmering point. Simmer, and then okay. we're going to go ahead and take it off the heat. The bubbles rising, it's starting to get warm. Do you think the milk is spicy yet? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite yet. I think we're getting close though. So we're gonna get this to simmer and then we're gonna let it hang out for a little bit? Yeah, so we're gonna cover it and let it steep for 15 minutes before we move on to the next step. So this is very unlike um, the other mocha recipes we've done because you're not, aside from pulling the espresso shots, you're, we're not really, we're not steaming the milk or anything, right? I mean, this is technically kind of steaming it, right? No, but on the espresso machine, <laughs> yeah, I no, mean, it, yeah, this is very, this it. is very different. This is kind of like the way your grandma would have made a mocha. <laughs> if you, um, maybe if you had, you, but you, what's nice is you can do this with. Um, uh, like stovetop mm -hmm. espresso, like uh, you don't necessarily have to have an espresso machine to do this recipe. Nope. It's kind of cool. It is. All right. You know, from the steam coming up, I feel like it's making my throat tickle. I think that... <laughs> <laughs> oh, from the chili? Yes. <laughs> so um, I guess that means we're at a simmer. Okay. And so what I'm going to do now is take it off the heat and cover and let it uh, steep for 15 minutes. All right. We will be back in 15. Okay. Okay. okay so we've let it steep for 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to add our other ingredients. Okay. And so we are going to start with a half cup of powdered sugar. One and a half cups of regular sugar. Mm hmm. That's a lot of sugar. Mm hmm. And three cups of espresso. And then I'm going to put this back on high heat, bring to a simmer again. And while I'm um, simmering this, or bringing this to a simmer, I should mm -hmm. say. Oh, you know what? One more ingredient. Oh. We're going to use most of. That's my timer. <laughs> Sorry. We're going to use most of this um, cocoa powder. Okay. We're going to save a little for the next step. The next step I have in this lovely process. So I'm saving about a quarter cup. Okay. So what we're going to do next is take heavy whipping cream mixed with the rest of our cocoa powder. Mm -hmm. And we're going to make a topping for our mocha. So this right now, what we're doing is we're just going to let this kind of all incorporate well for a little bit mm -hmm. um, while it's still at the simmer? Yes. Okay. okay. So we're going to make our topping now. Okay. And so one cup of heavy whipping cream. And then about a quarter cup of cocoa powder. Mm-hmm. And now we get to whisk away. This is my favorite part. <laughs> Your bicep workout. <laughs> Starting to get some stiffness out of it. Mm -hmm. Where's my peaks? I need peaks. <laughs> <laughs> Look at those peaks. We are pretty much there. Look at that. <laughs> Okay. Very firm. So I'm okay. going to let this sit over to the side for a minute. Mm -hmm. um, so this has come to a simmer and it's ready. It's ready to try. Um, so I'm going to remove the cinnamon sticks and the chilies. We don't want them to end up in anybody's cups. No, no. Way. It's like um, a little surprise though. It would a little be. spicy I mean, surprise. Especially if you bite into one of these suckers. Now that's a spicy paella.
It's like playing a game. <laughs> Find the cinnamon stick. Mm. You know what? Maybe mm. I'll find them later. Yeah. We could probably It'll safely ladle. They're hanging out at the bottom. Yeah. It smells delicious. Mm hmm Now, the one thing is, like, this is very sweet, but there was no sweetness in that whipped cream mixture. So that might be a nice balance because it'll be very cocoa-y. Mm-hmm. So you're just going to do a dollop. Or two. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever your mood takes you. I think it deserves two. Mm-hmm. There we go. I'm excited. <laughs> That's really good. Yeah? I'm trying to find the spice. Oh. <laughs> it's at the end of the sip. <laughs> that was great. Trying to find it. You were like, trying to find the spice. Oh. <laughs> it arrived. <laughs> like, get it without the. That is really good. Hot. Mmm. <laughs> that is really yummy. Yeah. Warmed my belly. Mm-hmm. Mm. Good job, Brandy. Thank you. So that was a spicy mocha. Yes. All right. Thank you very much. You're welcome, Kat.